channel. This fucking rising channel. This fucking guy drew a rising channel. I know he fucking drew a rising channel because I drew it. Then you get into a rising channel with falling volume. And you hit resistance, resistance two, whole steam of resistance, and upper resistance three, four, five. And every time you see, critical thing to pay attention to here, every time you see, let me get this shit out so you can see it better. Every time you see these candles up here, when you're hitting the top part in the daily can, and these are daily candles. This isn't minute, five minute, hourly, or four hourly. These are daily candles. Anytime you're seeing a pump in the daily, right? The daily candle and then a long wick at the top. See that long wick? We need to change that color. Get it to a color we can see. See how you have a long wick here and then it's down and then the body of the candle is down there? That means uh, when it closed, you closed down low, right? You closed, you, you, you closed um, off the high of the day. That was the high of the day and then you closed lower, right? And every day you did that, you see that one day, two day, three day, every fucking day, it had the same thing on those wicks. One, two, let's get our little pointer tool out here. One, two, three, four, five times you hit this upper resistance. Upper resistance hit five times. And all five times, you had heavy sell pressure at the top end of those candles. That's signifying a top. Usually, if you're trying to read the Heikinashi candle, uh, that's a sell, That's a topping signal. Let's get some of this shit off again. Anytime you see a, a long wick at the top in a daily candle time frame, and the base of the candle, right, the base.